Hi there, welcome to Kevy Shaves. Nice to see you. Nice to be back here in the bathroom on December the 31st, which is New Year's Eve, or as we call it in Scotland, Hogmanay. Uh, Hogmanay has been called that for many, many, many years, uh, and that's uh, what we call it here in the, the land of the Scots. I have the Scottish flag on the wall there, the St Andrew's Cross, the saltire, um, that's on the wall just to make it a little bit more Scottish, if it's not even Scottish enough. You ken what I mean? And there might be a few of those that slip in. You ken what I mean? Purple. <laughs> Some people uh, like me saying, uh, purp is it purple? I don't know what it is. Purple raindrops. Purple raindrops. I don't know. <laughs> right, I'm going to start the shave by um, wishing you all a very happy, healthy, prosperous, 2022. I hope it's a lot better than the past couple of years have been, health-wise and everything that's been going on. So I raise my glass to you all, to you and your family, friends, loved ones. Uh, thank you very much and all the best and Happy New Year. It's very early in the morning so um, I'm just drinking blackcurrant juice because I wanted to get this filmed and then get it edited and uploaded um, before the bells came in before the, the, the sound of the, the bells for New Year uh, here in the UK and Scotland anyway. So let me show you the soap. This is a, it's a Wickham soap, yes, but it's called Buddha Wood. And it's made especially for the gentleman's groom room here in my home city of Dundee. Here it is here. Yeah, beautiful scent. Um, this is uh, one of the, the first ones that came out. They've changed all the packaging now on their soaps. Uh, they have their own labels now. So here is a picture of the Buddha Wood label as it is now. If you go to the website and purchase it, that's what it looks like. Uh, there you go. The guy kind of looks like me after eating all the crap I've been eating over Christmas, but <laughs> we'll deal with that later. Uh, yeah, so Buddha Wood. So the notes on this are Rose Otto, Sandalwood, Amber, Ginger, Buddha Wood and Oud. It's a very masculine scent. It's very nice, very well blended. Uh, yeah, just really, really good. Uh, the brush is this. This is the Gentleman's Groom Room Limited Edition 2018 brush. Uh, and this handle is Natural Oxhorn. Uh, you can see it there. It's a synthetic knot. It's a, uh, I think it's called a blonde tuxedo knot. So a synthetic knot. Yeah, very nice, very hard. Yeah, it looks great, it looks great, and it's not slippy when there's water on it and stuff like that. So, uh, all good. Right, the razor. Beautiful. Executive shaving, Claymore. Single edge razor. It has the uh, executive shaving logo on the bottom there. You can see it. Yeah, there it is there. It also has it under the head here. Under the... Uh, so the handle comes off like this, beautiful handle, all stainless steel, comes apart like that. As I say, it's a single edge razor, blade fits on there. Um, and I have, I'm going to use a, a feather pro guard from Japan. So that's the only thing that's not Scottishy <laughs> in this uh, shave. Right, this is what I do with the blades. Once I've used them, I put them in a little folded piece of paper like that. I just put it on a feather pro guard. Um, so I have one in here, and as you can see, it has one dot on the blade, just with a, a sharpie. There we go. So that means it's been used once. So this is its second use. And the thing with these feather pro guard blades, why are they called pro guard? Well, if you see the blade at the, the bottom there, they have little uh, little guards along the edge. Just to make it, make it a bit more forgiving. So what you do is, you get the blade, you place it like that, can you see that? On these two little posts, put the base cap on, like that. If you do things carefully, you have to whisper. Do it very carefully. Make sure it's together like that. And then you can just screw that on. Yeah, this is a very smooth thread. <laughs> he says struggling to get it on. No, oh, there we go. Yeah, it's a, it's a nice long thread, but it's very smooth. So there we go. That's the blade inserted there. You can see it sticking out the edge there. Perfect. 
Right, let's uh, start the shave. I'm just gonna put a little bit of water on this soap. Just, uh, I'm just pressing in the sides, just so the water doesn't go down the sides, but you know what I mean. Yeah, just so it's a, a tight fit. <laughs> a tight fit. Oh, New Year's Eve gave you a tight fit. <laughs> what a load of letters. Right, yeah, there's a little bit of water on that. Swirl it about, just to soften it a little bit. A wet brush. I'll give it a shake and a flick. There it is there, damp. And we'll just go straight in. What are your plans for New Year's Eve? Or if you're in Scotland, what are your plans for Hogmanay, big man? What are your plans for Hogmanay? Are you going out to get pished? <laughs> That's a Scottish uh, little word for drunk. Are you getting pished? I was pished last night. It doesn't mean you've peed your pants. It just means you're absolutely ripped. <laughs> I was absolutely pished. So were you. So were you, big man. I don't know. You remember getting home? No. I woke up this morning, looked at her lying next to us. She was like that. Give me daggers. And I goes like that. Sorry, hen. I was pished. <laughs> right, I think that. <laughs> I think that's a good enough load. <laughs> Kevin, you talk utter pish. Right, let's go with that. Let's wet the face. Paint it on. Yeah, so you're maybe watching this uh, on New Year's Day or at a later date. So how was your New Year celebrations? If you're watching it after. Or if you're watching it before, what are your plans? So many questions. Stop asking questions. Why? That's the only way you get answers. So it is. What's the only way you get answers? By asking questions. Right, I'm going to put some water in this. Mm -hmm. Great scent on this, really, really nice. Yeah, a lovely balance of everything in the soap. More water. More water. Yeah, this is a, a Wickham's based soap. So if anyone's used those soaps, you'll know how good it is. It's a vegetal soap. So no tallow or anything in it, but really good. Really, really good. Yeah, so we've um, we've no great plans for um, New Year's Eve. We'll, we'll see it in. We'll see the bells in, and then, um, as I say, everything's kind of curtailed with the COVID stuff here in Scotland. The big party, street party, the biggest street party in the world is cancelled in Edinburgh. So. That's not going ahead because of COVID, but I would just suspect there'll be lots and lots of house parties now. <laughs> People just going crazy. And celebrating into the weekend, I would think. See, as it's a Saturday, that New Year's Day. Right, that looks good lather. Great brush, this. Yeah, I don't think this is available. I'm not sure if there's any um, other knots with this handle still available. Look at that, look at that soap. <laughs> Superb. Right, I'll go with that. Put that back on there. Clean up a little bit here. Where's my towel? Where's my towel? Looks good, looks good, looks good. Yeah, I don't have that much growth, but I just wanted to get a shave in for um, before New Year. So I'm heating the razor and blade, here we go, with the uh, executive shaving. <laughs> Claymore. <laughs> a 
uh, someone asked me before, I think it was, um, was it Golden Steel TV or um, Kev, whatever your name is, I can't remember your YouTube name, why do you laugh sometimes when you, after you take a stroke with the razor? Well, I'm just, uh, I'm just laughing at how smooth it feels, <laughs> like, wow, that is uh, superb. I know it doesn't make sense to some people watching, they'll be like, why would you be like that when you're just taking a shave? Well, wet shavers, tell them. You don't understand, we're a weird breed, us wet shavers. Yeah, so... Uh, Twenty twenty two, eh? Twenty twenty two. Well, I wonder what this year will bring us in terms of uh, shaving and stuff like that. Who knows? That feels excellent. Nice slim profile for under the nose. Yeah, perfect. Right. Nice residual slickness there. Right, let me rinse and come back for pass number two. Okay, that's that rinsed. Let's go back to this brush. Yeah, it's a great scent on this. It's, um, although it has rose in it, it's kind of um, balanced out with the, the woodsy notes at the, the base. And then the oud right at the end just kind of rounds everything off. Really nice. Yeah, the gentleman's groom room have a, a few of their soaps, a few of their own soaps. I mean, they have their um, the other line, which is the traditional as an essence of Scotland. I think it is. They have all those, and they have these ones, the Berry Fields of Blair and uh, May Chang. The other one, great. Great lather. Beautiful. Right, back to this. Claymore. Oh, that was, <laughs> that sounds like a lightsaber. <laughs> right, across the growth. Wow, that is amazing. So smooth, so smooth. Yeah, I think uh, Europe, Europe and the UK, uh, this razor was made by Executive Shaving. Uh, if you want to buy it in the States, you can get this one, Executive Shaving, or you can buy the Alpha, Alpha Shaving, which is a, uh, Exactly the same razor. It was a kind of collaboration, but um, they're branded. It's just the branding that's different. The name on here is obviously Executive Shaving if you're buying it in, from them, and anywhere else it's Alpha. No overhang. Good. Look, a couple of little whippers there, little dots. Don't know if that's from the last shave, actually. Yeah, so the new year, it's a time for um, new beginnings and also um, to remember those that have passed on. Um, I'm sure there'll be people. I'd uh, lost some people this past year, in 2021, 
And it leaves a couple of shavers, um, Will Carter and She Shaves with Jill. Uh, very sadly left us. I think Jill was last year, wasn't she? It's two that I know of anyway. There's there's probably more. I think there was someone else, but I can't remember what their name was. Uh, so apologies. But um, yeah, just remember them. Right. Okay. Second pass done. Wow. <laughs> There's hardly anything left, but when I go like that, I can listen. But when I go like that, it feels smooth. Right, let me rinse and come back for the third pass. Okay, back for a third pass. Right, I'm just going to scoop what's in this tub. Not much. A little bit. Just dip the tips of the brush in a little bit of water. Mm. Just enough soap, perfect. This big moon. <laughs> this big moon. <laughs> I, I, I'm actually wondering um, if the things around the world are still going ahead. Like the, uh, I know London still having like fireworks and stuff, but. Is the thing still happening in New York in Times Square where they, they drop the ball, the big time thing in Times Square? I don't know. Probably see it on the news tonight. Anyway, <clears throat> back to the shave. Thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> right. Uh, against the growth. Yeah, these blades are um, quite forgiving, the Feather Pro Guard. Um, some people prefer the Feather Pro, which I have. I was going to use one of those, but I just thought, oh, I'll just use this. Um, yeah, they're very good blades. The only thing with a single edge, you need to keep rinsing. Remember to rinse, rinse it often. But this rinse is no problem. And of course, remember, please remember, remember, <laughs> please remember, <laughs> please remember, um, if you're buying anything from Executive Shaving, like this or soap or anything, use the code KEVY5, which is on the screen right now, and you'll get 5% off your bill before shipping. Because uh, it all helps, right? So if you buy from Executive Shaving, use that code. And tell them Kevy told you to use it. Yeah, Kevy told me to use this code 5%. Any chance of another 5%? No. <laughs> We're Scottish. No. <laughs> You'll be wanting the shirt off my back next. <laughs> <laughs> oh man <laughs> Right, come on <laughs> You'll be wanting a shirt off my back next <laughs> Right, stop That feels good. Right, let's have a quick rinse. Feels great. Yeah, usual spots for the pickups. Um, yeah, you. <laughs> as you get older, um, you speak to people about about New Year's Eve, Hogmanay, and stuff, and uh, everyone in your age group seems to say the same thing. It's not the same as it used to be. It's not the same as it used to be. <laughs> 
Yeah, it's not like when we were young. Well, of course it isn't. The world changes. It's not like when we were young. Yes. New Year was different. Hogmanay was different when we were young. <laughs> you still get, um, I wonder if you still get kids hanging about outside shops. They do it here, they hang about outside them. Um, uh, kind of shops that sell alcohol and stuff. They're not off licenses, they just sell everything, newspaper, cigarettes, food, everything, over here anyway. And um, you'll get kids going out saying, Mister, could you go on and get me some drink? <laughs> and like, they offer you money, and I'm like, yeah, because it's usually if you go in and the, the police turn up, <laughs> you get fined, you're the one that gets fined, not them. Mister, I used to do it myself. <laughs> Mister. Did you go in and get us some cheap cider? I wonder if the kids still do that. They probably just order it online. <laughs> just uh, pick it up there. Right, let's have a little deal. Yeah, there are a couple of little dots here, but it feels good in general. Really, really good, actually. Yeah, just a tiny little bit there. You hear that? Down that drawing. Right, I'm going to use the Allen, but I'll have a face wash with this first. Um, just because. <laughs> right, so I'll rub this in, rinse it off with hot and cold, uh, then I'll use some alum and then we'll come back for the post shave. And it might be New Year 2022. Oh no! See you soon. Here we go. Last shave of 2021. Feels great. Right, on to the post shave. The matching splash. Yeah, this is what the labels look like now. Uh, Buddha wood. Yeah, nice bottle, clear splash. A little nice restrictor in there. Oh, a good glug at that. I put some alum on so it shouldn't sting too much. Nice scent. Yeah, it smells like the soap. Beautiful. Oh, really nice. And to finish it off, I bought this uh, along with the soap before the aftershave came out. So um, here is the matching Soothing Poche Balm Buddha Wood. Yeah, the Wickham's Balms are absolutely, really, really good. Absolutely amazing. Just need a couple of pumps. Not used to that in a while, so. But. Yeah. Yeah. Same, same smell as the soap and that. Yeah, these balms are uh, very, very good. It leaves your skin feeling like silk. There we go. That's me done for 2021. 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 I was thinking of something that rhymed with two there, but I didn't want to go there. <laughs> right, there we go. That's the shave. Very good. Very nice. Feels great. Right, let me show you what I've used in today's shave for Hogmanay 2021. Uh, Buddha wood from the gentleman's groom room, made by Wickham. Very good soap. There it is, all cleaned out. Beautiful. Uh, great scent, easy to lather. It's a vegetal soap, so anyone can use it. Um, just very, very good. The brush was the gentleman's groom room, limited edition, 2018. So a couple of years old now, um, well, three years old actually, with the white tuxedo synthetic knot. This is natural oxhorn. Very good, great brush. I don't know if there's any of these left. They might have some of these in uh, with badger knots, but I'm not entirely sure. But I'll put links for everything if I can find it, and you can go and check them out. Uh, the razor was the Executive Shaving Claymore Single Edge. Fantastic, really, really good. Can you hear my stomach growling? It's needing breakfast. <laughs> um, inside that was a second use, I was gonna say a brand new, second use Feather Pro Guard. Uh, so that was that there. Great razor. Very smooth, very, very smooth. Lovely weight and balance. 
nice snarling on the handle. Yes, it's just really, really well made. Great razor. From Scotland, of course. Um, <laughs> we did three passes, pickups, a little face wash, then I used the Allen block. Um, there was a couple of little tingles down here where this weeper were uh, and that thing there, but nothing else really to speak of. Post shave was matching splash, gentleman's groom room, Buddha wood, and finished off with the matching bam, Buddha wood. And that's it, ladies and gents, for 2021 from Kevy Shaves. Again, I'll raise my glass and say a very happy new year to you all. If you're still here, thanks for watching. Thanks for all the comments. Cheers. All the best. Um, right. I guess I'll see you in 2022. Um, thank you for all your support over this past year. Over the past six years, actually. It's been incredible. Um, the subscriber count has continued to go up, which is really, really good. Uh, I've really enjoyed making these videos while I can. It's been a bit hectic recently, but um, we'll get there. Hopefully we'll get some other things filmed. Um, I've got some ideas for stuff, as I always have, but it's just finding the time, as you know. Get some outdoor shaves, hopefully, um, and some uh, lunacy. <laughs> Who knows? I never know what I'm going to do. Right, but um, just to say uh, all the best for the coming year, uh, and I'll see you next time. Goodbye from Scotland. Uh, and have a healthy, happy, prosperous new year.